we just got to the Giles, town of Oxford, where Oxford University is. I saw a sign saying Red, uh, Redcliffe Square. Is that for this, this no, Christchurch uh, College. They were Radcliffe like Harry Camera. Potter. The stairs that go up to um, the Great Hall in Harry Potter is in Christchurch uh, College. Some deer. Thirty months of deer. Yes. This is Deer Park again. All the deers are just kind of congregating over here. Pretty awesome. Enjoying their land. Cash and I found this walking trail right by Oxford and we're standing on this interesting little uh, concrete bridge. I guess I could take canoes out, or kayaks, whatever these are, at um, Oxford. Still on that trail, it kind of wraps around. Because we started seeing, finding people from our group coming the other way. Why are you in there? Why are you in there? Why are you in here, sir? I, I gotta make a call. There's no oh, phone in here. There's no phone in here. I'm, I, I don't know, I, I'm the opposite of a claustrophobic. I like tight spaces. These are the dorms of the Oxford campus. We're going to see uh, Wicked from London play about the uh, evil witch from the Wizard of Oz, kind of like her side of the story. I do not remember that from the Wizard of Oz. This is the land of Oz. Is that Middle Earth? Yeah. You look like Wilbur Slip. What? Woo! I know. We're going to be there by 2322. Uh, exactly, says Matt. <laughs> uh, anyone, anyone have anything they want to, you know, get off their chest at this point? You know, we can do a bit. Amazing, thank you! Oh, no! That's good to get off your chest there. It's like, you know, something you kept secret for ages. Yeah, hold it back. Don't don't display your emotions and display them now. No, of course. Thank you. And you guys, open. Uh, Crack go with the suitcase. It's celebration time. Do I like the states? It's a strange offer. <laughs> You can pet my dog if you come to Mississippi. I saw that at Craigslist once. <laughs> you can pet my dog if you come to Mississippi. <laughs> this is a you be very careful what, what you answer. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. 
Okay, okay. Anything else, anything else anyone wants to say about, you know, their entire experience? I don't like beer. Don't like beer? Well, you know, maybe this is maybe even your first travels and uh, if you enjoyed it, great. Go and, go and do some more traveling. Like, uh, uh, Ian was saying to me today, like, studying abroad. You can study abroad, that's completely possible. Like, don't do that. I actively encourage you to go and see new places and do new things. Like it doesn't, it doesn't have to cost stuff. I'll tell you right now. I've never, whenever I've travelled, I've always had people pay me. Just go and find companies that teach English. You know, you teach English to people. Right? There's plenty of companies. Uh, travel, do some things, do some things. The next day. Okay, just got on the plane and it's been a nightmare. Thank you so much for watching this series on the European vacation. I'm sorry it took so long. I've just been <laughs> just been busy. A lot's been going on, but uh, everything's going great. Um, it, I'm very grateful I got to experience that. Probably some of my favorite point parts were uh, uh, probably Abbey Road. That was a huge bucket list thing of mine, seeing that and getting a picture on the crosswalk like the Beatles. And, um, Scotland, Edinburgh was a, such a beautiful city. I absolutely loved seeing that and being a Harry Potter fan, you know, knowing J.K. Rowling mo wrote most of the Harry Potter series there. And you could see kind of how as you maybe got the inspiration with the castle sitting up top above the town. So that was awesome. Um, Ireland too, Dublin was cool. Seeing like, uh, you know, you know, drinking the Guinness and then in Cobb seeing where the last port where the Titanic stopped at. Um, and just seeing London too, in general, seeing that's a city I've wanted to see for a while. So just seeing that going on the London Eye and all that, it was just such an incredible experience. And I highly recommend it. It was with this uh, company called EF Tours, Education First. And it was just a really, really nice tour. It was a lot of time in the bus though. That was the one thing, but uh, I got some sleep in and you know, you gotta travel. So gotta like go from place to place. So. Overall, I thought it was just an amazing tour. Um, I still plan on uploading more videos. Just, uh, it's kind of been a lot with work, but things have been going good. I've got my own place, this beautiful place. I got, it's a nice condo and uh, everything's just been great. And uh, looking forward to making some more videos. 
So stay tuned and thank you so much for watching. Take care.